Hi everyone, welcome to our channel. In this video, I am going to explain about the malaria. Malaria is caused by plasmodium parasite and it spreads by the bite of infected mosquitoes. Whenever the person has malaria, it usually starts with shivering, chills and it is followed by high fever and followed by sweating and return to normal temperature. Generally in malaria there is missed fever pattern. It means one day there will be high fever and other day there will not be any fever. Along with fever there will be muscle ache, tiredness, severe weakness, headache, nausea, vomitings, diarrhea and there will be rapid breathing and rapid heart rate. Along with these symptoms there may be black colored urine. Usually, the malaria is transmitted from mother to unborn child. It is also transmitted by blood transfusion, sharing needles, etc. Malaria is diagnosed by blood smear test, ELISA test and complete blood picture. In CBP, there will be decreased hemoglobin, decreased platelets and there will be increased LDH, etc. Coming to the treatment, generally the malaria, the doctor may advise paracetamol for fever and there are certain anti-malarial drugs like chloroquine, mefloquine, quinine, primaquine, artemenicin, etc. If the malaria is not treated in proper time, it may have some complications like it may spread through the brain, cerebral malaria and there may be breathing problem and there may be anemia that is decreased RBC, decreased hemoglobin, there may be low blood sugar etc. We can prevent malaria by say, taking certain precautionary measures by like when we go out we should use uh, protective clothing, we should wear long pants, long sleeves etc. And we can use bed nets and applying certain insect repellents like odomas to the skin and using certain insecticides like heat to reduce uh, mosquitoes etc. This is all about malaria. Hope you like the video. If you like the video, please share and subscribe our channel. Thank you.